Hey there, Extreme Squad. Welcome back. And if you're new here, I'm Cody X behind camera for one time. Usually I'm always in front, but first time me being behind camera. Anyway, we're going to be doing a TCG talk about video. Yeah, I don't really know what I'm going to title this video. So, yeah. I'm going to be talking about my TCG game called Monster Wars. And yeah, if you don't know what TCG stands for, it stands for Trading Card Game. <clears throat> and excuse me, I got drainers today, so don't mind uh, clearing my throat. Um, yeah, anyway. Um, this is Octostorm, if you don't know what Octostorm is. Um, I talked about this character in the video where I talked about my TCG and all that um just I'll either post it in the link description or you can just go back it'll be like one video before the last two videos um but anyway we're gonna be talking about my first ever if I can get out, I'm about dropping my phone. My first ever cutouts or rough cuts. These are basically my first ever um, paper version of my TCG. Um, these are just um, pieces of printer paper so the ink has bled through the paper some um, again these are test versions these are not the finished product um, don't laugh at the fact that we are not good at centering <laughs> we're still learning how to center it <clears throat> center it um, yeah, so let's get into actually talking about the characters, the cards. So here's, sorry about my camera. Here's the first card. This is Auto Storm colored version. Um, yeah, I'm actually working on redesigning this character, making it more appealing, looking, and changing up the colors. Um, if you don't know what this is right here this is the bleed out zone this is basically a um, layout for the game crafter and if you don't know what game crafter is it's a company that helps people that makes DIY TCGs makes it where they can actually make their games professionally they are a company that specializes in making games on like board games, TCGs, several different types of games. Um, but again, this right here is Bleed Out Zone. This is where they tell you to watch your character if you don't want anything to get cut off. That right there is where they'll cut off from. That little dots, those little like dots is the border. Again, you don't want your character to go off there because that would be filled with a black or a different color um, border. I'm not exactly sure if that's custom or not. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, but again, I am redesigning that character to actually work with the border. But um, anyway, this right here, these... This is what I'm actually going to be talking about. This is my layout of my game. My cards. Well, my original layout. I'm working on a new layout that looks a lot more cooler and a lot more better. Um, keep in mind, I am not good with leveling. I'm not good with coming up with perfect leveling for the attack, defense, and levels so the numbers might change when I actually get to where I'm doing it. And my hands up close to the camera you're probably getting annoyed 
But anyway, um, that right there and this are going to be changed. I know for a fact that I'm going to change up the attack and defense along with the CP. CP is usually for, um, like life points and stuff. So that's going to get took off and replaced with a special, um, point system that I will get to talk about later. It's going to go with the elements. But, um, yeah, I'm going to be changing that up with the attack and defense and other levels. Um, so that was Auto Storm. Here is one of my favorite designs that I did. This right here is a character that I made based off of my pet dog named Thunder. Again, I ain't gonna redesign because half of the characters going off of the border. Um, anyway, this was my first ever K9 monster design. It looks cool, but I'm gonna redesign it and make him more appealing looking. Again, I named him Thunder based off of my dog, Thunder. Thunder Wolf. His element is stone. I'm going to change that to a electric element to make more sense with the name, including Auto Storm. He might be a dual element. I'm not exactly sure, but yeah. Same with this one. I'm going to change up the defense and attack to make it more leveled out. Um, but yeah, that's all I'm going to say right now. Um, if you're curious on when I made these, I don't remember if I said this at the beginning. I made these cutouts like two and a half years ago or a year and a half ago. I made this around the end of 2020. So, yeah. Well, anyway... Stay awesome, stay extreme, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.